Today, Kevin and I have three Wild Ophelia candy bars we want to try for you. Uh, this is the Confetti Cake White Chocolate and Sprinkles, the Cookies and Cream White Chocolate, and Hazelnut Cocoa Toast. These were sent to us from Sarah in California. Thank you very much to Sarah. She said that these are brand new, so I can't wait to try them. They're gluten free. One bar is 310 calories. That's of the um, uh, confetti cake with sprinkles. 310? Yes. And that one's different is the hazelnut cocoa is 300. I broke off one piece, but you could probably uh, hold that up. Mm. It's got confetti pieces in it. Okay, this says... This badass bar is made with passion and purpose and magical all-natural sprinkles, white chocolate, and bits of gluten-free vanilla birthday cake. Very sweet. Mm -hmm. It's sweet, but it's also creamy. Mm -hmm. And it also, you get the bits of the sprinkles. Mm -hmm. You get a little crunchy bits. I like that, but I, nice. even I could not eat a lot of that. That's no, very, very sweet. It's incredibly sweet. Um, it reminds me of almond bark instead of white chocolate. I agree. It has a really strong The vanilla. first ingredient is white chocolate. Yeah. But <coughs> I can understand why you say that. Pretty sweet. Almond bark is very, very sweet too. <coughs> um, I don't know. A lot of people don't even know what that is, but we, um, when we make Oreo balls, we use uh, almond bark. It's like that. a dipping, it's not chocolate, it's really no. a dipping candy, really. That is a very nice bar. Though. It is This good. is the cookies and cream. Um, it says this, this badass bar <laughs> is made with passion and purpose. Our classic chocolate wafers are lovingly crafted in Middle West Indiana. The layers of crunchy cookies are crumbled into our vanilla rich white chocolate. First ingredient in this is white chocolate. One bar is 310 calories. So both of these are the same. Crushed up cookies on the bottom. Yes. I like them. It has a really good cookies and cream kind of flavor. It sure does. I love the texture. I like texture. that one better than that birthday cake. I do too. Or confetti one. I do too. And that it's shocks good. me because most of the time I would have chosen the birthday. Yeah. But the cookies and cream, it has the texture of those cookies on mm -hmm. it. And it's just the the pairing of the cookies with the white chocolate and it's yeah, it creamy really too yeah it goes really really well together incredible flavor i like that and the the dark the chalk the the cookie pieces are a little bitter so it takes away from some of the sweetness mm -hmm. so um, not like bitter like in bad just in, in a little less sweet so right. it takes away some of the sweetness of the white chocolate so it's really good this one is literally just a plain there's nothing to show it's just chocolate hazelnut <laughs> cocoa toast this badass bar is made with passion and purpose and ground dry roasted hazelnuts swirled into milk chocolate, which is speckled with texture from toast-like crumbles. Well, there's nothing to see here. Hazelnuts I mean, swirled into milk chocolate, but now there's no, you can't, there's no visual swirl. No, you um, can't see anything. Uh, and this one's only 300 calories. I like that. Mm-hmm. Me too. It has these little crunchy bits in it. Mm-hmm. It's almost like salt. Do you get a really a salt flavor? I know. It's very salty, but I love it. Mm. I had a little, um, like a really strong salt flavor out of that. It's really good. I like that. It has milk chocolate hazelnuts, and then it has these crushed crepes dentils biscuits. Mm. And then, but it does have sea salt. Yeah, the sea salt is what I get mostly. Um, I don't really get hazelnut. It tastes more like a coffee than a 
that hazelnut. It it does. Um, yeah, and it there's a bitterness to it. Mm -hmm. uh, you would think that it was more on the dark chocolate side, but it's it's 41% milk chocolate. Yep, but that's I think good. I like them. Because of the hazelnuts, it does give it that little bit of bitterness to it, the little bit of an edge to it. I love the salt though. They could have they could have put sea salt on here, where a lot of places don't put sea salt. I mean, do put sea salt and you can't taste it. They didn't put it on here and you can taste mm -hmm. it. That's that's a very good bar. Um, I know the order of my favorite. Um, I'll probably go cookies and cream or cookies, whatever the cookies are. Cookies, cookies and, and cream. cream. And then the hazelnut one and the white and then the confetti. Me too. Yeah. Yeah. And we don't always agree. Uh, but yes, that, that would be mine as well. And truth be told, the confetti one is almost so sweet. I don't think I would buy that one again. But either one of these other two, I would buy again. If you're crazy about sweets, though, I mean, you super would, sweet. Super sweet, but but you're not going to eat the whole thing in one sitting anyway. But these are very good bars. Very, so very thank quality. you very very much to Sarah for sending these these to us. We really appreciate it. I'll have a picture for you at the end. And thanks for watching.